for 5, the gradient of the curve at a point is 2. Find the value of A and B. So when it mentions the gradient of the curve, it means that it's dy over dx. So at point, negative 1. So what does it mean by negative 1? So this is the coordinate of x and y. So when you find dy over dx, then you know dy over dx when x is equal to negative 1, you get dy over dx is equal to 2. So this is what the question is saying. Right? Find the value of a and b. So you see here you have y is equal to ax plus b over x square, right? So here is equal to ax. So you can bring the power up because you don't want the power to be below. You don't want the x to be below. If you can bring it up, you bring it up. So x negative 2. So you can find dy over dx, right? So dy over dx is equal to when you differentiate ax, the one with only x, you will take what is in front of x, which is a plus or you can you see here this is negative 2 right so power multiply with what is in front which is negative 2 times b you get negative 2 b you see negative 2 times b and then you minus the power with 1 x minus 2 minus 1 so here you get a negative 2 b x negative 3 which is also equal to a minus 2 b over x 3 you see here x negative 3 you bring down it will become x3 so you have this 2 so you see here it's giving you one point which is negative 1 negative 7 over 2 so this is the value of x this is the value of y so we are talking about this point so this point can also be included in this you see here you have y and x so when you substitute you get one equation when you substitute here you get the second equation then you can do simultaneous equation so you see here a so when y is equal to negative 7 over 2, so from 1, y is negative 7 over 2, negative 7 over 2 is equal to a, x is equal to negative 1, plus b divided, so this one x is equal to negative 1 square, right? So here, negative 7 over 2 is equal to negative a, so b divided. So, plus, so b divided by negative 1 square is 1. So I get b back. So this is the first one. So we see here the second one. So dy over dx. We know at this point we only have x right. So we can substitute x to get dy over dx. So we know that dy over dx. When x is equal to negative 1. Dy over dx is equal to 2. So when you substitute this one. So we know that a minus 2b divided by. So, x is negative 1, negative 1 cube is equal to, so it mentioned at this point, dy over dx is equal to 2. So, this one is equal to 2. Now, you have a minus 2b. So, negative 1 cube is negative 1 is equal to 2. So, this one would be a plus 2b is equal to 2. So, you see here, negative 2b divided by negative 1, you get positive. So, this is the second equation. So here you see negative 7 over 2 is equal to negative a plus b and here a plus 2b is equal to 2. So you see here when you have two equations you can do either you want to do elimination you can elimination or substitution. So any of this one lah either you find like either a or b and you substitute inside other equation or you can just eliminate lah what I want to do here. So I have negative a and a. So I know negative a plus a, I will get 0. So I plus these two so that I can remove a. Negative a plus a is 0, right? So b plus 2b is 3b is equal to negative 7 over 2 plus 2. So this 2 is equal to 4 over 4. So I get negative 3 over 2. Or you can use calculator lah this one. So here 3b is equal to negative 3 over 2. So b is equal to negative 3 over 2 divided by 3. So I get negative 3 over 6 which is negative 1 over 2. So when b is negative 1 over So here when b is equal to negative 1 over 2, I can substitute inside here. So I see here 2 is equal to a plus 2b. So a is equal to 2 minus 2b. 
which is equal to 2 minus 2, negative 1 over 2, which is equal to, so 2 and 2 can be cut off, 2, negative, negative will become 1, so, which is equal to 3. So, here, A is equal to 3, and B is equal to negative half. So, number 6, the volume of a sphere increases at a rate of 20 pi centimeter, centimeter cube per second. So, the volume increase at a rate of, you see here, this one is according to time. So, we know that dv over dt, so volume change to time is 20 pi centimeter cube per second. Find the radius, so it wanted to find what is r, when the rate of change of the radius, so you see rate of change of radius, you see here time. So, this one is, see, radius per time is equal to 0 0.2 centimeter per second. So, we know that the rate of change, so what? The rate of change of time is equal to, so when you have V here, you need to have dV also here. So, what can you find? So, you know the formula of volume, V is equal to 4 over 3 pi R cubed. So, from this one, you can find dv over dr. So, you have dv, you have dr. So, you can substitute. So, here dv over dr is equal to. So, here, okay, just do a, this one, 4 over pi. You bring the power forward. So, 3 r. After you bring 3 forward, then you need to minus the power with 1. So, 3 minus 1 is 2. Or here, you see, you can directly multiply 3 and 4 over 3. So, that you will get. 4 pi r square. So, here you have dv over dr. So, if this one is dv, this one is also dv. So, dv over dr times dr over dt. So, you can see the right one and the left one is equal. You see here, if you cancel out r, you can get dv over dt. So, right and left should be equal. Okay, so you have dv over dr, right? So, dv over dr is 4 pi r square, where you can substitute r times dr over dt is 0 0.2 and then dv over dt is 20 pi. You see here. Okay, now we can find what is r here. You see, this one is 20 pi is equal to 4 pi times 0 0.2. So, here you get 0 0.8 pi r square. So, you see here, you can cut off pi here. So, R square is equal to, so you want R square, you bring 0 0.8 to the left. So, 20 divided by 0 0.8, you get 25. So, R is equal to 25. So, you get plus minus 5, right? But then, for a radius, it cannot be negative. So, this one is not accepted. So, R is equal to 5. So, this one is in cm. So, R is equal to 5 cm.